Yo, so I guess wanted to talk a little bit of how you guys got it all good. Like, look at this, man. Look, look at this. Look at this item drop information. They are literally letting you know where everything drops. That is so cool. Look at that. You guys ain't even got to ask no more. You guys ain't got to harass people crying and all that stuff like Look at this. It tells you everything that drops at the catfish camp. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Is, this is actually really dope, actually. This is really nice for newer players. You guys can literally see the loot tables. This is literally like Atlas Loots and BDO. This is probably the coolest thing they've ever added. And I know that all this information, like as you play the game, um these things aren't really a secret or anything like that like you really get to the point where like as me i already know these loot tables i already know what drops in these areas but the things that i don't know is things like this like you know what type of crystals and stuff like that because usually i thought that any crystal had a chance to drop you know anywhere you know that's was my understanding or whatever and i knew you get some more crystals in some places or whatever but this is kind of really cool Look at this. Look at this. Hex shows you the. I wish they gave you the drop percentages. Now that would be dope. And look, it even gives you the path. Like, what more can you ask for as a noob, though? What more can you ask for? Holy crap, this is so cool. I didn't even know this. I didn't even know you could get the ancient weapon core from there. Soldier's Grave. What all did they drop? This is this is just so dope. Helms. What's the most expensive items they drop? Damn, okay, okay, Helms. Okay. I'm pretty sure I'll be farming the hell out of hounds, and I ain't never got an ancient guardian seal. So this damn drop rate for this this item must be minus 32. Cause I farm hounds. You guys know I, I mess with helms. Eric's let's see what drops here. Nothing, nothing really. Nothing, nothing good. Anyway, I guess forbidden books are probably the best thing. More forbidden books. Nothing good. Oh, Salsons. Wow, Salsons doesn't really have anything either. Straight up booty cheeks. I wish it, it showed the um white item, the collectible item as well. See, none, none of that stuff. It doesn't drop anything good. Let's see, where, where the good stuff at, though? Abandoned Iron Mines. Abandoned Iron Mine should be able to drop just about all the gems, so I wonder if they have it somewhere else. What is this? Oh, how to obtain. Okay, this is like some other type of set thing. I wonder if you can. You can't plus that up. I think it's already like somewhat plus. Nothing drops from Abandoned Iron Mines. I thought they gave you those little cookies that opened up into more gems. Apparently not, though. Apparently not. This is another. Oh, there's three parts. Okay, so they have they have four parts of abandoned iron mines up in there. Oh shit, centaur belt. That's that's okay. Most of the stuff is okay. What is this? And magic neck. What the fuck? Is this just this is just a regular necklace, right? There's a high chance of successfully enchanting it. I but if the enchantment fails, both will. Okay, so we can plus these up now. I didn't know that. That's that's really cool to know. Why didn't you guys tell me you could plus up the Azula set now? And how far can you plus it up to just pry? You guys need to let me know these things. You we we be on Discord all the time. You guys don't even communicate, man. You know what? done with you guys i can't believe you guys kadri oh kadri drops the good stuff these serif necklace i was addicted to these things before i stopped playing a while back <laughs> i i'm not gonna lie like i i farmed like three of these like every day like i'm not even not even for, i didn't farm them from there like i farmed the money and just bought them straight out of the marketplace and i was filling them like crazy let me tell you yo i was so sad you know, I need to get a value pack. Good thing I'm about to get a seven day one. So that's mad, dude. Soil, dude. Okay. 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 I really. All these places. Like, look at this desert. Desert Nagas. Desert Nagas don't drop shit. 
Oh, wow. A sickle. I wish they chilled the drop chance. Yo, the, the drop chance would have made this so much better. Upgrade compass part. No, oh, yeah, I think people need those. I think those things are expensive as hell. When you create the item or something like that. It allows you to teleport back. Tongue grads. Okay, we know where to get all this stuff from now. There ain't no hiding now. Look at this, you guys. You guys can literally find out how to farm everything in a game. To be honest, these are what you need to be farming because these drop rates for these things shouldn't be that high. And they, if they're going for like, you know, six and 10 mil a piece or whatever, that's really good money. Holy crap. Yo, why is this error 75 million? Oh, yeah, you definitely need to be farming here. Man Challenge Forest. Oh, yeah, I know those things. Okay, okay. And is this a, this is just like a trash item that sells for fifty thousand? Damn, these yo these are, yo if you have the if you have the gear to be able to farm those all those are like really good drops. You have a chance of getting that um that air like it's just so much so expensive. Holy crap! All yo all the places down there are, are dropping really good stuff. We need to go down there and farm. Truffles, who gives a hell about the truffles? It seems like all the good stuff drops in Common Hill. Look at all this. I don't know why this is so expensive though. Like it's especially now that the sword set is on, like you can plus it up. I wonder how far it pluses up. Holy crap, this belt sells for 125 million at base. What kind of belt is this? Black Spirit Rage Weight Limit. I guess people out there nuking people with their Black Spirit Rage. That's really dope. I guess it'll allow you to use your ultimate more, which I really never thought about. Probably make a video on that later. But if you don't know how to use this feature, well, you should know how to use this feature. It's right here. It's item drop in the menu. And that's really dope. I wish they showed percentages and we would be set. Because then we would know, really, it, percentages is all that matters. If they showed the percent drop rate of those actual items, then it would be a wrap. Like, we would definitely know the best places to farm for money, the highest percentages, all that stuff, you know. And, it, you know, you do calculations depending on the um how thick the mobs are. You get it? How thick the mobs are? Raffle, this is King Vox. Like and subscribe.